how did it feel though, like to, to be locked up? You hear your music getting played, you hear people talking about you, like you hear fans wanting to find out what's going on because a lot of people didn't know the situation. I mean, that, that must be frustrating as an artist. Yeah, no, it was frustrating. Like, I felt like I'm just losing my chance. Like, my career's on the line. I, like, I've made it this far and I've come from Brixton and I've got out of that, that little conflict stuff and all of that. And I've made it this far and now I could just lose my chance. So I was really shocked and stressed and, but I'm back, man. A lot of artists have been inside, you know, like Tupac, you know, you, you've got various other rappers who've done time. When you're in a cell, was, was that making you want to write more or was that making you just like, I don't know, just, just disheartened? I would say it's both. And it's just, it's just hard when you know you've got a career out there. Like if certain people go jail and they ain't got nothing to come back out to. But I went jail and I knew, it made me realize that this is my only chance to ever get to improve my family's life, my life, and anyone else's life I can improve. And yeah, man, that's what made me feel stressed, really stressed in there. So, so listen, you're back out, like, what, what's the plan? You're gonna stay out of trouble? I don't, I don't want to sound patronizing, but I know a lot of people missed you while you was inside and you got a lot of things going on for you. Yeah, no, definitely, I'm out of trouble. I'm, I'm not even getting, I don't even get in trouble, but this was just a one-off. Promise you, I'm out of trouble, facing my music. And yeah, man, only up from now. What's, what's the immediate plans? Because, you know, you, you know, you, you're out on the streets, you're back, you know, you're available for bookings. Hollow at Billy, actually, WME, Hollow at Billy. But you're back for the bookings and everything. So what, what is it that you want to do next? Is it a mixtape or is it starting work on an album? Is it another single? It's another single and then start working on my album. And then anything that I don't feel like could go on the album, I'll try to put it for a mixtape. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Any producers you want to work with? Is there anybody you want to reach out to? Um, Ill Blue and that. Yeah, man, there's a lot of producers in the pipeline right now. They killed it with the wave though, right? They killed it, they killed it. Time takers as well, I want to work with them. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Drake followed at you on Twitter. He knows about the jet ski wave. What's, what's going on, man? People, there's rumors going around that you've been DMing each other. Like, what's happening with that? Yeah, man, nah, we spoke, but obviously, I don't even want to talk too much about that. But yeah, Drake Hollard, he's on a jet ski wave. <laughs> you see it in the damn, see it? 